Gadget Master. All right, yes, uh, straight to the main point. Yes, my name is Maurice, the Crochet Master. This I'm around, as you have seen the highlight, I would like you to give me your time so that you can understand this type of a short piece yes we call it the curly brush piece and you know why i call it brush is just because of how always cut it up to down and um, when we come to the styles of cuttings yeah the haircuts yeah when we cut um the brush hair cell i know you understand what i'm trying to say so this time around please i just want you to give me your time if you're still new here in this channel please let's just do this now straight to the main point here i just wanted to focus here mostly uh some of you guys when you do a short piece that sometimes you feel pain when it comes here in the middle so here there was something that people have been doing like most of the times when you make it too tight when you're here in the middle it will have to pain you at all so that middle the center is very very important and i would like to advise you guys whenever you're doing this type of a cornrow please try to make it as soft as possible when you reach here uh, uh, uh the center the center that uh yeah, because if you make it very tight trust me it will pain until the end so let's try to make sure that uh, we focus on this and now then another thing that some people when they try to sew here they make it still too tight please i beg you let's try to do it as soft as possible yes and now when we're done with that we all know that our short piece is always um it takes a little bit longer yeah yeah but yeah, when we play to short piece we just imagine it can take like a month or to two so what we always do is to add um, the ant each so that it does not pain us at all and then after all that just try to massage it and then we add this net so that it is not uh, straight to the scalp other people are uh, just put on this net uh, because uh, they use bond but for me i just put it uh, there for um for to protect that and still i don't use the bond so that is the only difference that i do when it comes to that so we start doing the sewing now if when it comes to the sewing we all know that from the beginning like this layer it is supposed to be uh the the, the hair the, the the piece like we always trim to that, that that we always trim it like over trim it when it comes to the end so we can only just put uh, the one layer and then we just just have to keep on adding we just keep on adding until we finish so um that is the only thing then another thing that i would like to show you guys is that uh, most of the times when we are uh, sewing this a uh, short piece is that you just uh, have to put in your mind that according to how you're going to cut it then if you need you don't need to use a lot of uh the 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 the, the, the weave yeah make sure that maybe let's uh, say that on the sides we always overcut it um and then uh, uh if we had, we cut the side it means we just have to put a little you understand yes if if now uh behind we have uh we, we are putting like um two layers that means uh on, on the sides um we just have to use one layer so like here i just used one just because we are still at the beginning and we all know that if it's a haircut when it's down here we always overcut it up to down so you just have to keep on adding just like that then when it comes to the trimming of course we already know how we are going to trim but now here comes that i got this creativity and I, I just had to do it and i always tell you guys whenever you think of something just just do it the way it's supposed to be trust me you will see something good coming from it so when i thought of doing something like this trust me uh, i had to do it and then um, I imagine that if I trim the hair on the sides to be um, on the side to, 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 to look few, you understand, then on top and I try to crochet something that is curly, 
I found out it is going to look something that is very, very interesting as you're going to be seeing in this video. So let's just watch this.
so when i'm done crocheting my <laughs> uh, uh putting my crochet here i'm adding the the the, the moss uh, for the other crochet because uh, it is always good for these curly crochet the moss is good to, to keep those curls yes after doing all that you can see how it is coming out and i make sure that i'm doing the same color that matches with this so you can see how it comes out very nicely yes i just had to do it so when you think about something please just do it trust me it will come out very nicely so if you still have something that you'd add you want to ask me just go right now in my comment section tell me what you think about this hairstyle i'm gonna be signing out my god bless you all but remember i work at hair by clippers hair by clippers that is hair by clippers with a z you can always search for it and come we work on you yes i'm found there so just come to here by clippers we shall do the exact work that you already see here bye bye